Hey guys, I'm 146 Lady here. It's Saturday, May 28th. So we're here at Faso and Sons Garden Center on 108th and Cicero. It's a little bit of a drive from Chicago, but it's well, it's really well. Uh, I can't even speak. It's really, really worth it for the prices here. They're exceptional. And sorry, I'm speaking so fast, but I kept trying to record this video and it keeps cutting off. So let me try one more time. I'm gonna just show you real quick what I got. I got two curry plants. Those were $3.99 each. Um, I got some lemongrass. Right here I got um, early girl plus tomato. I got some zucchini, cosmos and zinnias, lobelia to make tea. Um, what is this? Uh, Cherokee purple. I see this on a lot of people's channels. I was watching Lady Led earlier, so that's why I wasn't recording while I was inside the actual center. I got some 101010 10, 10 fertilizer. We got some sriracha pepper. That's for my older son, my teenager. He likes to do Asian cuisine. I got super chili. We got some spitfire pepper. I don't even know what that's like, but we're going to give it a try. We got a bush early grow. So it's supposed to be a smaller version of what I could put in containers because we don't have a lot of space to grow at my house. I got an old German. It's supposed to give some striped yellow ones. Um what's this right here i got a black prince tomato when i was trying to get a black crim so i'm just gonna roll with it because it's crowded in there i'm not trying to go back in right now i got my son already in his car seat so i got a chocolate sprinkles tomato a candyland red i never heard of that before in my life but i'm gonna give it a try and back here i got some pineapple sage and that is excellent for attracting pollinators and then there's my baby i call him my baby but he's almost four years old already and i apologize if he screams but he has autism so a lot of times instead of trying to talk he'll just make random sounds and i got some landscape fabric so there's a little spot right next to the garage where they're gonna let us use it for planting and then the rest of the land right there they use it to plant some um what do you call it? They plant flowers there every year. So sorry for the mess back here. It's clutter. That's what happens a lot of times, you know, because I carpool with my neighbor's children as well. And then I got a cast iron skillet back there. My first one ever because I was watching Lead Farmer 73 and Lady Lead the other day cooking outside doing a challenge. So check their channels out. Also check out um, Container Crafts of Scaredy Cat Gardener. Check out, um, who else? Check out Lion Crest Outdoors. Um, I want to name everybody before the camera shuts off. I apologize if I don't get around to it. Check out Black's Tropical Homestead. They'll teach you how to grow some pineapples. Um, check out, um, who else? Let me think. Check out Time to Grow. Check out Tasha Oh She Grows. Check out um, Container Crops, the Scaredy Cat Gardener. And there's so many channels. Check out Hollis and Nancy's Homestead. Check out Tommy Bites Homestead. They'll keep you up to date. And another channel that I love watching is Poplar Preparedness. So check them out when you get a chance if you even see this video. And if you like it, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to, to subscribe if you want to see more videos. Hopefully my little guy will go to sleep, take an afternoon nap. And then hopefully I'll be able to get some of this put into the ground. And if not, I'll show you whenever I get around to it. So have a blessed Saturday, y'all. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. Much love to you. Many blessings and greetings from Chicagoland. This is the Psalm 146 lady, and I'm out.